hair. Um, I do like to purchase wigs every now and then, and I've been purchasing um, a couple of wigs in the past couple of years. So um, I'm trying to get my hand in to learn, you know, how to do the laying down the, the lace and whatnot. But <clears throat> however, I don't want this video to be too long. But this video is just a um, a video I wanted to do really quick to help you guys out there to help my fellow brothers and sisters to not get scammed on Facebook and don't get scammed by people pandering and pretending to be black businesses. Um, that's the one thing I hate is when you think you're purchasing from a black business and it is not a black business. It's ran by whoever else and they're not black, but they will pander and, you know, cater to our vernacular and which means, you know, talking black, if that's a thing. And, um, you know, hey, sister, hey, girl, when I, I just hate that. So anyway, last night I was uh, scrolling around on Facebook and um, because I've been looking at wigs on, you know, other websites, Facebook and Google, get into your business and see what you have been looking at. So they um, recommended this company to me on Facebook. Um, you may have seen this company. I don't know, but I decided to put my investigation skills to at to test uh, because um, I had time today, and I uh, found a lot of interesting things about this particular company on the screen, Dynax Hair Beauty Company. So, like I said, I was scrolling through Facebook, and this video popped up, and right away, I see an Asian woman and I see a black woman in a video, right? And I see a couple of, you know, you see these down here. These these pictures look very familiar to me. I'm all over YouTube. I watch a lot of the gurus, um, you know, get wigs from companies and put them on. And they're influencers. So we go and run out and buy the wigs because we want our wigs to look just like theirs. Um, so, you know, these, these this is familiar pictures to me. You may recognize some of these people, right? So um, I then look at her, right? I think she is supposed to be the owner. If you know this this lady, please contact her because I think they're using her picture um, and uh, she doesn't know because something about this is very, very scammy, okay? So I look at her. I'm like, oh, okay, she's a sister. That's, that's definitely a black girl, right? She's in Canada. And it says here, you know, Dynax hair's hair goal is to build a one-stop wig system to create a perfect shopping experience for customers. Fine. I ain't trying to go to Canada for no hair and all that. But, um, so I, I go in and I'm like, wait a minute, this is a, a wig company created by a black woman. Let me, let me see what this is about. Like I'm, I'm, I'm feeling this. Let me, let me see if I could support her. So I go into did I click? Let me see. Let me click on this. Okay. So I'll click on Dynex Hair Beauty Company. This is their page. It says shop now. So let's go to shop now and see what we see here. Okay. Here's the website, right? Right away. Here's right away. Here is a red flag. Three wigs for $55. Uh, where? Where can you get three Virgin and raw hair extensions, three for fifty-five dollars. A whole wig, right? Okay, let's go down. One hundred percent natural. Sorry, one hundred percent superior quality. Shop the collection. Okay, I know you know. Um, I think what's this girl's name? Uh, I forgot her name, but I, I watch her channel sometimes. All these pictures here, all these videos are popular YouTubers that we all know and love. This is um, Taste Pink right here. This is Miss Naturally Mary. I couldn't think of her name before, but it's Peak, Peak, Peak something. I know they are not wearing wigs that cost $34. I know it's not happening. I know it's, I know it's not real. Here's all the pictures, $20.96 for a 26 inch straight human hair bundle. Brazilian virgin Remy hair, okay? $25 for this short little blonde. All these wigs are cute. They're beautiful. I would buy them. Look at this. I mean, you could just go through the pages and scroll through $60 for this natural curly looking uh, style. Um, 
we can go down a little bit further to the next page. Some more YouTubers. Uh, this girl's a YouTuber. Um, here's, um, what's this girl's name? I can't even think of their names right now, but I watch her channel too sometimes. I know that they are not wearing these wigs. Um, I can't think of nobody's name right now. Peak Mill. That's Peak Mill right here. Um, so yeah, beautiful wigs, you know, lace, the baby hair in the front, pre pluck wigs. This is Meg's, Meg's, I think this is Meg's, um, Dominique down here. Yeah, I know all the YouTubers. So how on earth are all these wigs this cheap? How's a bundle $25 and 85 cent? No freaking way. So I go back to Facebook. And I say, I want to see who's actually buying these wigs because I don't know who these people are, but I feel like it's something here is not connecting for me. Something is not connecting. I don't know who these two people are, but here's me. This is me, y'all. I said, can you do a live? Because I was just like, get on live and show me these wigs in your hand. I want to see you. Um, I want to see you hold this wig in your hand. I want to see you comb it. I want to see you put the wig together and show me that it's your business. You're saying that you're a black owned business. So this, let me get to the fun part. Forget all that. Forget that. Let's go to the, let's get to the fun part. So I look down here, scroll down a little bit. This is their page. Um, they have Dynex Hair Beauty Company again, and this may be a real thing. This Dynex Hair Beauty may be a real company that's teaching girls how to do wigs and more power to you if that's what you're doing, sis. Um, you know, keep it up. I would love to take a class and learn how to make a wig. But for some reason, something is still very scammy to me. So let's go back. Um, let's go to where I found the comments. So here we have dedicated to the business of wigs for black women right all right click on the comments i see everybody in a mama purchasing wigs okay let me make sure i'm still recording just place an order i'm super excited and i hope i'm not like exposing well i guess i'm not exposing because it's a public website anybody can see their names okay I'm going to click on the people who said that they purchased the wig because that's what I wanted to see. I wanted to see reviews from people who have actually purchased the wig. I've been on this site all day yesterday and all day today. This is the first time I see an angry face. Everybody else was raving. So I'm just trying to help you guys not get scammed. Okay. 291 comments, 217 shares. This company is about, about to make bank. So this lady right here, I'm not going to click on her personal thing, um, but she just placed an order. She's super excited. This lady, she just ordered six wigs and she can't wait to get them. Six wigs, if they were really the, the quality that they say they are and they were $26, I would probably buy six wigs just so I could have them. But what I'm going to do is I want to click on somebody's page who said they already had the wig, right? Cause I'm, I'm, I watch the ID channel because I want to learn how to do investigative reporting. I don't watch it because I don't have stuff to do. <laughs> I, um, I'm on a, I'm on the ID channel all day long. So let's start with this lady right here. I'm going to come back to Una, to Una Vance. I'm going to come back to her. Cause this is, I'm telling you, this is funny. You're going to love what I find, right? She says, Abigail says, I'm very satisfied with this unit. I ordered it in 18 inches. The color took very good. Um, but I'll come back to her. Let's go to, uh, where was her name? Abigail. No, not Abigail. This, yeah, well, well, let's, let's go to Abigail. So I said, okay, let me go to Abigail's page. Cause I want to see if she is taking pictures in the wig. I want to see, um, you know, who, what the wig looks like in her hand. So I'll go click on her page, right? Who is this? Who, who, who's this? If this is you. Who is this? First, this is my first red flag. Okay. Go down Abigail's page a little bit. I don't see any more pictures of Abigail. I don't know who these people are, but if you're black, you know, real talk, why do you have random white people in your profile? Okay. Moving on. Her friends. 
her friends over here. All 412 of them, see all friends. I'm telling you, I was all in this all night long. I couldn't sleep because I was just like, I'm so excited because I'm going to put them on blast. All these weird bots, okay? These are bots. These are all paid for bots. Any YouTuber, any people, any person who has a website, um, Instagram, you can pay for followers, you can pay for likes, you can pay for subscriptions. These are all paid people. I promise you they're paid bots because, oh, oh, oh. what? Who are these people? These are your friends? All men, really. I mean, you could go all the way down, all the way down to, now we're in the M's. All men, Hindu, Indian, Asian men, okay? Let me give Abigail the benefit of the doubt. Let's go back to the comments. All right. Um, who else did I look at last night? I looked at this lady here. Una Hill. She purchased three wigs because she supports black people. Wh who are the replies? So this lady right here, Marianne Love, I think um, she said, Una Hill, can you inbox me a picture of your wigs? Because... Mary Jane, look, Mary Jane is very concerned and she wants to find out, you know, if this is a real company and they don't want to get scammed. So I go on Una Hill's page. Una also has a very scammy ass Facebook page. Here's Una, all right? I said, oh, pretty black girl. Okay, she looks like, you know, she takes care of herself, the bird. Okay, anybody can have a bird in their profile photo. She works at Facebook, Here, Facebook app. That's her job. Here's all her pretend interests over here. Okay. I read between the lines. I don't believe half the stuff I see. She has 886 friends. Here are her photos. Okay. Random white people again. Very scammy. Don't believe it. Here's her friends. Let's, let's see all friends for Una. Same random Indian men friends. I'm not saying you can't have Indian friends. I have an Indian friend. <laughs> I'm not saying you can't have friends from other cultures. That's not what I'm saying. So don't get it twisted. Don't twist my words around people watching. I'm trying to, I'm trying to school y'all and help y'all not get scammed. These are more bots people. These are bought and paid for bots that this wig company has purchase to, uh, look like real customers. This is what we have come to people. Okay. Let's go back to the comment. So now there was a comment. Somebody said, um, Oh, here, Sherilyn Wilder. Sherilyn Wilder is a real person. So I'm not going to click on her profile, but I am going to click on the replies because I'm going to see, I want to show you what the owner said. Okay. You can read it here. Sister, sister, we are a real black owned wig company. We know that there are many scams on Facebook that may have hurt you, but rest assured that we will heal your wounds and restore your trust. You may be wondering why we sell so cheap. Yeah, I'm wondering why you sell so cheap. It's because we are a directly licensed boutique with the factory. We supply many famous brands of wigs, blah, 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 blah. So we are holding our biggest discount ever to give back to our fellow black people. Love you. Um, tight. Okay. At this point, I'm pissed because here go your girl, Una, who's helping them out. And she says, I bought it. It's a legitimate black business. We already saw that Una is not a real person. Okay. Four replies. Here's Una Vance. We got an Una Hill. We have an Una Vance. They're all bots. Sorry. I don't want to keep throwing that out there. Dynax Hair Beauty Company said, well said. Here's another one. Adama Aminata. She might be real because she's asking for the code. And then they say there's no code, just, just pay for it. Marva Brown said, thanks for reassuring. Thanks for this reassuring response. I also had the same feelings of these site. We'll definitely do more. We'll definitely do my ordering. I feel so bad for y'all. I feel so bad for y'all. Y'all are getting scammed, scammed to the max because when you get your wig, it's going to be doll hair wrapped up in dog fur. I'm telling you, it's going to be fake. There's no way you can get this type of quality wig hair 
for $55. It's not happening. Not even $55, $20. That's that's the price that they have on the, on the site. My poor sisters is out here asking, has anybody brought one from here before? They'll just get one of the bots, the bots to um, respond for you, for, respond for them to you. And here's Una again. She purchased three wigs because she likes to support black people. If I was naive and saw that, I would be like, oh, let me help my sisters out. Let me go ahead and purchase from their website because this is a black company. We're trying to get more black companies out here to do business. Let me help and support them, right? But then you go down a little bit uh, or yeah, you go, you go up. Let me find some more comments, right? No, go back in the comments. Um, Jen Griffin, she just placed an order. She's super excited. I want to find another person that I, I died laughing when I saw it. Where's she at? Her name is something about trash. Oh, here, here. Ismael Miles, right? I showed this to my daughter and she was like, mommy, that's a catfish, a catfish picture from TikTok. My daughter's all over TikTok. She's 14. She's all over TikTok. Okay. So I said, oh, let me click on her profile. Ismael Miles. Um, who is this? Who is this? Who this? If this you, who this? <sighs> so I'm already pissed again. Do we see anything in common now? Do we see a trend, guys? Here's, here's our bunch of friends again. Here's her profile pic. And here's some random photos of Miami. And here's her friends list. The same bunch of Indian men. I, I, uh, there's no way you all have the same friends. You can't, this, it's impossible. Random people from around the world with the same damn friends, the same type of friends. I watch Web of Lies, okay, on ID channel. I'm, 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 I'm into this. I'm, I'm all over this. So understand that this is not a game. They're playing games with you, but I'm not. I'm trying to help you guys out. Work at Facebook app. He works at the Facebook app too. 565 friends. Where's the other one? Works at Game Lovers. I'm sure these are not real people. It's impossible. They can't be real. I, I refuse to believe it. Um, One more I'm going to show you. And this was the funniest one for me. Um, look at all the people, poor things. How long does shipping usually take? Just ordered six wigs. I'm so excited. I like the one she has on. I like the curls. I just opened a package falling, falling in this beautiful color, not even speaking English. It's my uh, miles. Here's her wig. That's not really her y'all. Let's view some more comments. I want to find the girl. So Here's one here, Smith Rowe, who also works at Facebook app. Okay. I click on her. I said, okay, here, here's one. Finally, a real, a real person. She says she's a YouTuber. I went to YouTube. I couldn't find her page at all. Uh, her channel couldn't find it at all. Um, I'm looking at her profile pic. This and this does not look like the same person. She also works at the Facebook app. Bullshit. Portrait photography, Facebook, go on Facebook. You can see for yourself, go on this web. Well, you can go to the website. The website is here. Um, plain as day, $25, $23, $29. You, you, you know, damn well, you can't get away for this cheap, this type of hair. You, you know, it's just not happening ever in no country, no planet will you get hair like this. And this up here says glam extension collection maybe this doesn't even sound like the the name of the company from like like this girl this doesn't sound she has a spa and beauty personal care this and this don't match so before i go let me scroll down to um the about me i was like oh let me go check out the about me section See if it makes any damn sense about us. Um, they got a whole bunch of nonsense down here. Another Gmail account, very spammy. If this is a real business, you're not going to have a Gmail account. 
through Dynex hair. We love every passion and interest on earth because it is a reference to your hobbies. What the hell does that mean? And to spread exactly that is our core vision. Wait, hold on. Through Dynax hair, we love every passion and interest on earth because it is a reference to your hobbies and to spread exactly that. I, I'm sorry, but that's not English. I don't know what that means. I, it just doesn't make any sense to me. There's no picture of the lady um, that we saw on Facebook. I just think this is a big old scam. Please don't spend your money here. There's actually another website just like this. Um, starts with a K. I think it was like Kiki Wigs. Literally the same customers that was on this website. And I'm uh, not this website. But the same customers that were here are on that website. Um, on that Facebook page. And I am totally disgusted. I'm mad that they are pretending to be black owned. That's the that's the worst part is that you're pretending to be black owned. And then, yes, girl, let me like that. <laughs> um, pretending to be black owned. And then on top of that, you're stealing our money. And then on top of that, you're sending synthetic wigs. Please do your research, people, before you go giving them your money. Um, if you want to, you know, watch YouTube and watch your favorite influencer most of the time they're they are referring you to companies that are legit i've purchased wigs from um legit websites ref um referred to us by youtubers influencers and i just want to say those wigs were very good quality i'm satisfied but these facebook wig companies are a scam just just save your money and save your save your sanity and just don't do it like, I was tempted to buy one because I just wanted to get the quality and see what it looked like so I can have something to show you. But I don't need to. I'm telling you right now. Just, I, I did the work for you. I, I, I looked at them. I vetted out these so-called customers who all happen to work at Facebook, by the way. And they all have the same friends, the same weird type of friends. Um, and I hate to say weird because... You know, my family's Muslim and I see a lot of Muslim names and I don't, I don't mean to call them weird, but the situation is weird. Um, the, the group of people together, all the same, that's weird to me. That's really, really weird to me. I don't believe it. And, um, you guys shouldn't believe it either. Just do your research. And if y'all have any, um, comments, just go ahead and let them, let me know in the comments. I'm just rambling right now. <laughs> I'm sorry. Just let me know in the comments. Comment, please.